Okay guys, funny way to start this video, but there was a lot going on at home. So here we are. Today is day one. It is travel day. I am headed to Universal Studios uh, Orlando Resort again <laughs> with a couple of friends. It's kind of a, a fun little random spontaneous birthday getaway. Um, and I'm excited. A funny thing, my flight is on time. Their flight is delayed. So we're going to see if everybody makes it in tonight. Um, I just parked here at Raleigh Durham International Airport. For those of you who don't do this, quick tip for you is to make sure you book your parking online ahead of time. Not only can you compare prices and maybe save a little bit of money. There have been times when this airport parking area does fill up. So I highly recommend making sure that you purchase your parking spot ahead of time so that you're guaranteed a spot and you don't run into a jam when you get to the airport. With that being said, I'm gonna go ahead and grab my bag and I'm gonna head into the airport. I did have to drive around for quite a while to find a parking spot, but I did pay ahead of time. So I knew I would eventually find one. Um, yeah, and that's it. I'll be flying out on Southwest today, which is one of my favorites because I love how empty and quiet the terminal is. It takes very little time to get through pre-check. I do have TSA pre-check, which is a lifesaver, but I would honestly say that when you're flying through Terminal 1 at Raleigh Durham International Airport, you really don't even need it. So that's pretty much it. When I get to the hotel, I will be doing a dockside quick tour. Um, I am not sure if I have stayed at this hotel yet, um, but since we did book this trip last minute, that was the hotel that we decided to, to stay at. So yeah, that's it. I will see you guys soon. Notice when I fly to Orlando, if I fly out on Wednesday night and then fly back in on Saturday, I can usually get the best price for flights or use the least amount of points. So yeah, that's what I'm doing today. So I'm already through TSA pre-check. I already got my bag checked. It took me about 15 minutes total. That's why I love flying out of this terminal so much. Um, and I have about an hour until we board. So I just got to the hotel. It's about 10.30 at night. I'm pretty tired. It was kind of a rough flight. There's storms happening in Orlando, so I think we got a little bit of that, but I made it. And now I'm gonna get settled in and kind of just have some downtime um, before we head to the parks tomorrow. But first, let's do a quick room tour. Okay, so this time, I don't usually stay here, but I'm staying at the Endless Summer Resort Dockside Inn. Right away when you walk in is your shower and your toilet area. Um, it's a pretty good size shower. It has kind of a like a round shape that comes out. This is a handicap accessible room. So instead of having a closet with a door, we have a curtain. And then the sink area is over here, which I like because somebody can be in the shower getting ready while somebody can kind of be out here getting ready and it just makes the morning a lot easier. All right, so over here we have two queen beds. I do think the decor in here is just so adorable. Um, there is a desk area. We have coffee machines. We have a small ice bucket. In here, there is a mini refrigerator. So there is storage right here, mini fridge, coffee maker. There is a great size television, an extra chair. And then of course, we've got a pretty nice view. So that is it. That is the room. So I'm gonna go ahead with that being said and turn in for the night because I am pretty tired, but I'm excited to spend the next three days at the park and I will be doing more vlogs on that as well. So again, uh, if you haven't already, like and subscribe and I will see you guys in the next video. Ciao.